Hello everybody! Welcome! My name's Cal, and you're watching me play Streets of Rage 2 on the Sega Mega Drive. Playing this on my Wii U through the Wii mode, but you can play it on your PS4 and your Xbox Ones in the Sega Genesis Collection. It's out now. Uh, it's got a whole bunch of other stuff too, but Streets of Rage 1, 2 and 3 are on there, so have fun! Knock yourself out! What am I doing today? Well, this is stage 6, and I'm just taking a, a, a nice stroll along the beach, beating up punks and ninjas. Because that's just what you do when you go to the beach, isn't it? You, you see uh, topless dudes with red jeans and red ninjas, and you gotta, you gotta smash them. You do. Don't! Actually, don't do that! If you ever see anybody like that, please don't. Like, the, the, please, just don't. Oh, don't throw me! What is up? What's wrong? Was, you crazy? Gosh, here, I'll just throw a knife at you instead. Oh no, ninja stars! Who brings ninja stars to the beach? Come on! Alright, so Streets of Rage 2. What can I tell you about it? It's the best game in the world. There you go, that's all you need to know. It's a multiplayer game too, just in case uh, you're unaware. Two players you can play. It also has a, a dual mode, so you can fight against your friend, just you and your buddy. And, uh, you know, just knock yourself out. Literally. Not you, but your characters. It's actually quite fun. Um, here we go. Gonna take on, I think it's four of these guys. Three or four. Pheasant, and Falcon, and Condor. Ugh. Now, I'm just gonna try to get on this one side and try- Oh! Got kicked in the back! Ouch. Those kickboxer guys, I tell you what, they can be a bit of a pain. Hopefully I can make it to the next screen because I know there's a whole roast chicken out there for me. And that will heal me up good. Do 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 do. Boop. Alright, so we are on the next part of stage six. And I got myself a there it is, roast chicken. Look out for Hakuyo. <laughs> Sorry. That was awful. Um yeah, we are Oh no! Oh! I could see that happening in slow motion. You can hear him crying. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to finish him off. No, that's not quite enough, is it? But maybe I can throw a signal at him. <laughs> a blue signal, to be precise. Oh, I like that sound too. But um, I don't like what you're trying to do. You're trying to hurt me. That's really not nice. Shouldn't hurt people. But, Grand Upper, have that. Yellow signal. Oh, get out of the way. Oh. You know, when in doubt, just use your Grand Upper. Forward, forward, B. Now, obviously it's different for each character. Max does a slide. Blaze does like a little flip and then a punch type thing, which is kind of odd. And Skate will dash. You can just hold the forward, forward. Oh, I got, I got tackled. Uh, you can just dash for a while before you actually do the B button. So you can just run around, which is kind of neat. They ended up putting that feature into part three, didn't they? So everybody can just run by pushing forward forward and holding that and then I, I you know what I don't, there's no point in ever me becoming a teacher because I explain things in the worst possible way <laughs> all right look out for the big guy and fog actually these guys are probably more dangerous than this guy I don't like the bikers they just they just dash at you and then they really hurt you oh but then Gormand over there he's gonna breathe fire uh oh uh, hopefully I can just do little jabs like this for a while finish him off but I have a feeling- Oh! No, they can all join the party! No! I got knocked out! Look at him just chuckling away. He thinks this is hilarious. This is no laughing matter, Gormand. And then, oh, a little few slaps there. Okay, now it's funny for you. You think you've got me. Take that, Gust. Ah! Get out of the way! Ah! Oh! Alright. Oh, I just- I didn't want to throw him because that would have left me exposed to Gust here. Oh, what is going on? Yeah. I'll tell you what, Gormant, I'm not a happy man. You can have four knees. There we go, play it safe. Grand Upper, like I say, when in doubt. Grand Upper. Look out for these biker guys. There's gonna be a few of these. A few grenades. Concentrate, concentrate. Now, uh, the best thing to do for- ugh, is not jump on the bike like that, that's not gonna help. See, uh, when I'm jumping, I push down and attack. That way I can actually jump a little bit lower, so without accidentally jumping right over the bikes, I'm actually going to knock the guys off the bikes. Uh oh no! Rain got me! Is that his say it? I think that's right. Oh! Pipe your casca! Uh, I don't like them, they can, they can get you from a great distance. Oh! See what I mean? 
She's got that electric whip. It's just, oh my gosh. That's not how you do it, is it? I'm a little bit worried about these guys behind me, because that's going to happen. All right, keep away. Um, you just, just as long as you're moving up and down the screen, you'll be out of their reach because they can't whip diagonally, right? So as long as you're not on the same level as them, you'll be fine. But then you've got all these little minions, which are annoying as heck. Now we're up to the boss already. This one only has two stages, two parts to this stage, isn't it? First of all, I was walking on the beach and then I got here. So it feels like it was um, a quick walk, wasn't it? Anyway, we've got Souther and who's this guy? Who's this Jet? Is it Jet? It's Stealth. Ugh. Now, um, you can actually ignore the flying guy altogether. So as long as you beat up Souther, you'll, you'll win this level. But it's nice to just get him out of the way. See, look, he's already out. So now you only have to worry about one of them. Nice. There we go. It's not going to be too much of a problem when you've only got one to have to worry about, isn't it? And can I do my... Oh, yeah, I'm going to finish him off with an uppercut! Freeze frame right there. There we go. I finished that one off in style. That one is stage six clear. And you have been watching Carl play Streets of Rage 2. Thank you so much for watching. See you later.